there, YouTube? Chilling with Twisted420 here, and yes, we have uh, quite the contraption set up here, folks. This is a, uh, I saw a post on Reddit from a guy. He had a little mouse with it, though, but I ordered this one because it had the trackpad. Figured it'd be less stuff to have around. And he had a little setup where he turned his Galaxy Fold 2 into a little mini computer. So I figured I would come in. I wanted to get the same stuff. And you can do it all for under 100 bucks. So I figured I wanted to come in and just show you guys uh, what's going on. So I got this Spigen phone case that I stuck this on. They have a different version of this look stand that has a detachable mount to where you can still do wireless charging. I didn't care about that because uh, I was going to put it on a phone case anyway. But this thing 40 bucks. You can get it in a multitude of colors. It was on Kickstarter for a while, but I got to say it's quite the contraption. Now this is already quite the large phone, okay? So this isn't super practical. I mean, look at that. But it is fun and neat and it's cool to know you can do it. This is some Inspector Gadget type shit right here. So this thing goes on with adhesive, of course. And what you do, see, you unfold. Now you got different levels, different heights. So if you don't want to go too high, you can leave a couple of these down and they'll kind of stay where they're put. See what I'm saying? You got different levels, different heights. Basically, you unfold this, right? You got these little legs. They pop out. All right. Now, oh, well, let me turn this guy around. Oh, wrong way. It's kind of hard to figure out at first, but okay. So right now, it's just hanging out, right? You can let it hang out like that, but the beauty of it is unfolding. Now, the problem is, I got this on one side, so you're not gonna have it in, in, uh, in portrait. It's gonna be in landscape pretty much by default. The hinge, I don't think, can support that much weight anyway, but bam, landscape. So yeah, you wanna set up a little situation, say you're out and about, maybe staying at a hotel, don't wanna bring your whole laptop, bam, you got your Fold 2, 7.6 inch screen, all right and get everything done here and then bam look at this guy this is a bluetooth keyboard right here and uh it folds up i thought that was kind of cool now you could get a little slim mouse to go with this it'd be more precise but this is kind of an all-in-one solution and as you can see it works it works you can go pick some stuff and you know open up facebook and stuff you know do whatever you want you can do whatever you want but Hey, you got a lot of options here. Now this keyboard, it's not perfect. I mean, as you can see, the V and the T are smaller. When you get typing, it throws you off a little bit. You gotta kinda train your brain to remember to hit those keys right. But other than that, I mean, you got most of everything you would need here. So let's, uh, let me open up, let me open up my, uh, one of my note apps. There we go, keep notes, that'll work. All right, so let's just do something here. I'll just move this off here. The quick, oh, brown fox. Oh my God. I'm not good at typing to begin with people. So just kind of know that going into it. Jumped, oh, oh, no, 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 okay. Yeah, I'm a bad typer, but anyway, it works. It's not the perfect keyboard experience, but it does work. And it's got little rubber feet on the back to stop, stop it from sliding around. So that's kind of cool. Yeah, it's pretty much called Jelly Comb, and this was like 30 or 40 bucks. So yeah, all together, the stand and this keyboard, about 80 bucks. About, about 80 bucks is what you're looking at all together. And you got a nice little portable computer, basically. Turns your Galaxy Fold into a nice little portable computer. So yeah, I just thought it was something kind of cool. I'll give you a side shot here, show you what's going on. That's how it's kind of hanging out. It's better in this format because upside down, it's a little, uh, doesn't quite sit perfect, which kind of bugs me. It kind of tilts a little bit. So you could do it that way for a little bit more height, but yeah, this is the way to do it. A little bit of, a little bit of hanging action here. So yeah, look at that. That's kind of cool, right? This is really, really good engineering here on this, uh, on this stand. So yeah, fold her back up, take her. I'm telling you straight up inspector gadget, yo. I think that's cool as hell. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that. I thought it was kind of neat, uh, pretty cool. Yeah, you just turn your, with these two, you know, two things right here, turn your little phone into a little computer. I think that's kind of neat. Just a little something, something I wanted to show you. Oh, by the way, I still love this AirMade case. It's so thin, it's so nice. It gets really smudgy easy, but I've been using it for a while. It's one of the best little kickstand cases 
that they got out there compared to a lot of them. But anyway, that's all I got for you folks. That is my little Fold 2 computer. Uh, I'll have links in the description and everything, but that's what I got. I will catch you fine folks next time. Y'all stay sexy out there. I am out.